Hello friends, you are watching Android Tech Solutions and today in this video I am show you how can you install Jenkins in Ubuntu instance. Okay. So first of all I am going to launch an Ubuntu server instance and then we are going to install Jenkins in it. So you have to log into your dashboard and just click on services and under services you will find EC2. And here just click on launch instance. And here just scroll down you will find Ubuntu server instance. Okay, Ubuntu server image. So I'll just select this one. So this method will work with Ubuntu server 18.04, Ubuntu server 16.04, and the newer versions of Ubuntu. Okay. So I'm just keeping the rest thing default. So you can modify if you uh, according to your use case. And I'm not going to create a new security group. I'll name it as Jenkins group. You can give any name to your security group. And I'll add a rule. Add a rule of uh, custom TCP. As we know Jenkins works on 8080 port. So we have to open 8080 port from our security group. And I'm keeping this key pair as default. Okay, this is my instance, it's now launching. I'll just filter this. This is my instance and it is now launching. And okay, now I'll just copy the IPv4 address, the public IP of our instance, and I'll just open the terminal. So if I am using Ubuntu, so I am I, I, I am using terminal to SSH to my instance. If you are using Putty, then you have to use you have to SSH using Putty. So I'll do SSH, and the default user in Ubuntu instance is Ubuntu user. Okay, so you have to SSH to Ubuntu user. And if you try to SSH to EC2 user, it won't work because EC2 user is not available available in Ubuntu instances. And then you have to specify the PEM file. Okay, so here you can see I am inside the instance. Now I'll just do sudo apt update. Okay. Now I will do sudo. Basically, now I'm going to install Java. As we know, uh, Jenkins depends on Java. Okay, Jenkins is written in Java. So basically you have to install java sudo apt install I'm going to install open jdk This is the package name open jdk hyphen 8 hyphen jdk Okay now java is installed in my machine now I'll open the official website of Jenkins which is pkg.jenkins.io and here I'll go to debian-stable and here you will guide, get the commands to install Jenkins. So first of all the command, the first command what it is doing it is uh, adding a key. It is basically adding a key to your system so you have to just copy this and just copy paste on your system on your instance. The next thing is you have to copy this line under etc apt source dot list. So I'll just open sudo nano etc apt sources dot list. And here I'll just go to the end of the line and I'll just paste that uh, repository. After that you will just run, we have to run apt update hyphen y and now I will just run sudo apt install Jenkins
okay jenkins is now installed now you have to just start the service of jenkins by running this command sudo systemctl start jenkins and i'll just enable the service for the boot time and i'll just run this command to check whether the service is running or not systemctl status jenkins and it is up and running so I'll go to my AWS dashboard and I'll just copy the IP address and here I'll just going to open by 8080 port and here you can see Jenkins is successfully installed so I'll just configure this I'll just copy this path and I'll cat this file by running sudo so this is the initial uh, default admin password so I'll just copy this so I'll just install suggested plugins Okay, now it asks me to create an admin user, so I'll create an admin user. And I'll just click on save and continue. And save and finish. And it says Jenkins is ready. So we have successfully installed Jenkins in our AWS EC2 Ubuntu instance. So thank you guys for watching this video. Do like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more amazing tutorials.